Morning, Laurel. Oh, morning. Oh, I just had a full-on English. Stoking up my furnace. I hate airplane food. Are you flying this afternoon? Yeah. I'm all packed. Oh, I'm so sorry. I tried to persuade Sandy, but he's as stubborn as he is loyal, isn't he? Yeah. He's a lovely man. I'll miss him. I've never met anyone quite like him. Will you tell him I said goodbye? You can tell him yourself. He's at home now. No, I'm not great at goodbyes. There's still time, Mum. He could still go. We need to talk to Grandad again, please. You're right. Let's give it one more shot. Come on. Let's go. And she is as upset as you are. Upset? I've had and something in this eye all morning. Like a big fat tear. Because you know you're making the biggest mistake of your life. And at your time of life, you can't afford to. You know, I'm worried that you're going to regret it and you won't have a chance to fix it. It's not the olden days, Grandad. We can Skype you. Yeah. Just like we did when Gabby was in Australia. And throw caution to the wind. You can throw some clothes in a suitcase at the same time because that plane isn't going to wait for you. What's stopping you? Seize the day, Grandad. Just like you told me. Please, Sandy, you've got a real shot of happiness here. And we love you, don't we? And we'll miss you, but we want you to grab onto this with both hands. Ask yourself. What would Ashley say? Sandy, come on. <laughs> Australia, here I come. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs>